Well, the stage is all set for elections to the 29 seats in the Garo Hills Autonomous District Council tomorrow. Elaborate security arrangements have been put in place for the polls, which are being held under the shadow of a bunt called by the pressure groups in Garo Hills, opposing the participation of non-tribals in the Autonomous Council polls. Well, as many as 182 candidates are in the fray for the 29 seats up for grabs. And amidst the bunt call, authorities have assured to take all necessary steps to ensure smooth polling. A lot is at stake for the ruling NPP and the Congress in these polls, which is once again being seen as a battle of prestige between Conrad Sangma and Mukul Sangma. In 2015, NPP had won 10 council seats, followed by the Congress with 7, while independents had bagged another 7 seats. This time around, the BJP is looking to make inroads into the council polls. Moreover, new entrant UDP is also contesting in close to 20 seats, rendering the contest even more interesting. And with the alleged corruption in the GHEDC grabbing headlines for months, coupled with the bunt call given by the pressure groups, it will be interesting to see the kind of turnout registered tomorrow. The five-year term of the GHEDC expired on the 18th of October 2020. However, owing to the COVID-19 situation, the polls could not be conducted earlier. The GHEDC was then handed over to the governor for six months, which will end on the 18th of April.